This is the example problem on slide 69 of our chapter 12 PowerPoint. Question reads, how many liters of a two molar sodium chloride solution are needed to provide 67.3 grams of sodium chloride? So our strategy for ultimately getting to amount of liters of solution needed is to first convert grams of sodium chloride into moles of sodium chloride by using molar mass, dividing by molar mass. And then once we have that, using our molarity, basically dividing the moles of sodium chloride by the molarity to cancel out our mole units and be left in units of volume for our liters. Um, so we're going to start with the 67.3 grams of sodium chloride and use molar mass to get to moles. So real quick, molar mass of sodium chloride, if you add the mass of sodium plus mass of chloride from the periodic table, we get that the molar mass is 58.44 grams per mole. So now, ultimately, what we're looking for is liters of solution. And we're going to start with 67.3 grams of sodium chloride. We're going to use molar mass divide by molar mass to get us into moles. So that's going to cancel out grams and grams. Now we're in moles of sodium chloride. And now I can actually take my value, this two molar sodium chloride, and I can break that down into the fact that it means there's two moles sodium chloride per one liter of solution. So now if I take my molarity and put moles in my denominator and liters in my numerator, that's going to help me cancel out moles of sodium chloride and be left in units of liters of solution. So on the bottom is going to go my two moles NaCl, that's from my molarity, and on top one liter solution. So my moles of sodium chloride are going to cancel, I'm left in liters of solution. So now to get the answer it's just multiplying across, dividing my numbers on the bottom, and I get that you need 0.576 liters of sodium chloride solution to provide that mass. And that is how you solve another type of molarity calculation.